This is Duke University. On Monday, several dozen members of Duke's biochemistry department cheered and applauded for one of their own, Nobel Prize winner in chemistry, Paul Modrich. It was the professor's first day back on campus since receiving the high honor, which gave his colleagues a few days to plan a celebration. I had an idea of something. <laughs> <going on. laughs> Modric told his colleagues what it was like discovering he'd won. Well, I was absolutely stunned. I had. <laughs> I don't know what else, how else to describe it. It was just surreal. He also shared his trouble finding out the good news through email. The formal announcement from the Nobel organization that, you know, telling you, you formally that you've been awarded this prize, Apple Mail had placed in my junk folder. <laughs> Modric says the Nobel Prize won't change his lab's scientific interests, research, or approach. To me, science is, is bench work, and I've always enjoyed working in the lab. Reporting for Duke University, I'm Julie Schoonmaker. <laughs> Produced by Duke University.